we we totally we got new music. music. We got new sweet. jam. Yes, hello and With thank you. All new idol. That's right, all new idol. Hello and thank you for joining us for another All Star Idol Hour, a new Idol Hour of the one and only Idol Rap. That's right. That's right. I'm Justin Guariti. And I'm Kimberly Caldwell. We've got quite a show planned for you guys, you Idol fans at home. Mm -hmm. So let's not waste any time getting down to the nitty gritty. Should I just say nitty gritty? You did. Okay. Our first guest has coached the voices of Hollywood's hottest artists like, get this, Snoop Dogg and Rod Stewart. And he's sharing his expertise with us tonight. Please welcome James Lugo. Woo! What's up, man? How you doing? Oh, you're welcome. Hello. Hello. And I want everybody to uh, recognize that he looks very nice. <laughs> Handsome in your he jacket. Even, he even had somebody go out and get him a jacket today for this special show. <laughs> Yes. That's right. Excellent. Seriously. So now let's get right to it. What's your overview of the top 12 this year? Um, I thought uh, I thought there was, you know, obviously there's some people with really great voices, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, some people with not some not so great voices. Okay. <laughs> now before we get your specific more to get to, uh, like little David Archuleta, like I said, forgetting his words, poor thing, to a Beatles hit during the big show. We're getting to the bottom of it next, right here on TV Guide Network, America's Got Idol Headquarters. Oh. Sam, let's continue our look at the Idol hopefuls vying for the title Lugo. of American Idol. Next up is 17-year-old David Archuleta. Now, he struggled for the first, first. time yeah. during the Idol competition this week. Let's take another look at David. Oh, it just makes you cringe, because like, oh, oh poor, baby. poor guy, but you know what, he couldn't be in the bottom three if he tried. But you know what the best part was? At least he mumbled in key. Yeah. That's yeah. the key, if you forget the words, mumble in key. And yes. at, least he mumbled, at least he mumbled something. Right, yeah. Yeah. and the vowels were close, yeah. you know, so he did a good job. I was probably, you know, for a little, I mean, that's incredible yeah. pressure. Yeah. And he's a kid that probably How never listened to the Beatles. The Oh, I was like 22. Yeah, I was like yeah. 20, 21 on the show, yeah, and like I was I was completely <laughs> lost. So I can't imagine being 17. He's still there. So the Beatles celebration continued with all 12 finalists doing a little medley of the Brit band's hits. Take a look. Now, I am not a fan of group songs when we did them or when I see them, but this was actually the first one I kind of liked, and I'm talking about kind of liked. What was your opinion of the overall choreography and everything? It what? was that? You mean, oh, oh, wait, but, but choreography, step together, step, step together, step, step Think about together. all they have to learn during the week. It's like, are you going to give them some real complex choreography? But No, I was like, please, step together, step works for me. James, yeah. what do you think, buddy? Uh, it was... It was it was it was frightening in it, but it was cool. I don't know, man. It was it was cool. weird. It yeah. was just strange. It was like twelve people that don't mix, trying to dance, and most yeah. of them don't dance. So. The good thing about this year is that they are all solo artists. Yes. So putting them in a group is not going to work, you yeah. know. Right, like right, right. Like last year, actually, because uh, a lot of them, you know, had come from backup singing mm -hmm. or things like that. They all knew how to harmonize and blend. Very good together. They are like, hey, we are solo artists, and you can't really put us all together and make it not look weird. Just kind of the one-note chorus. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, really quickly, mentors are coming. Who do you think would be a great mentor for the idols? Quickly. Meaning, think, think, mentor, mentors, a mentor like, like J Lo yeah. was on last year, like oh oh, yeah. oh 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 maybe Britney oh, Spears, oh. yeah oh okay, oh, good. oh 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 Lindsay Lohan. No, you know who would be good? Rihanna. 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 Yes. Oh yeah, because yeah, she's young. The car. And Ella. she's young. She's, she's got a great voice. Yeah. And, and, but she's got game, and she's pop, and she's and she's she got it all. Interesting. She, she'd be great. And she'd know how to tell the youngins, you know, how well, to get into the entertainment industry. But the thing is, too, she bridges the gap between pop, R&B, and rock. Right. Because there's guitars and it's beats. It's like she's the whole, it's kind of like Pink. Like, it's the whole game. Mm -hmm. It's not, not like... Yeah, Pink's cool, too, because yeah. it's like the whole thing. Pink would be great, too. James, thank you so much yeah. for coming oh, on. You it's are more pleasure. than welcome to join us anytime Back, you'd like. like. Do you We've think... Got more um, David Archuleta, because he's been uh, the obvious front runner mm -hmm. for all the magazines, the sure. uh, you know the power rankings, mm -hmm. all that kind of stuff. Do you think that him forgetting his words last week? I mean, he's not going to be in the bottom three. Do you think it will hurt him? You know what? Let's cut the guy some slack. I mm -hmm. mean, you forget some lyrics, whatever. It was his weakest. It was his weakest performance, right. but. 
He's got some huge fans, and look, I think if I were to, if I were to bet on who's going to win, first of all, you know I love David Cook, but I think it would actually be better if he didn't win because mm. they'll probably give him some some pop thing that's not going to be good oh, for him. Final you know, song. I mean, look at Daughtry. You know, he didn't yeah. win. He's super successful. Yeah. But David Archuleta, American Idol hasn't had a Disney-esque artist. Right. And you look at the Jonas Brothers. You look at Miley Cyrus. And I also can't imagine David Cook singing a moment like this. Might be a little awkward. I can't imagine me singing a moment like this. <laughs> oh, but I had to do it. All right, guys. American Idol's top 11 finalists will perform for you again on Tuesday night on Fox.